Alright then, so here's a follow-up video to one of my last ones. This is the mead so far. This is the hydromels. The one I made with the Red Star Blanc yeast is still slightly hazy. And so as far as I could tell, fermentation went well with it. It is still sitting in primary and I will be racking it off soon so it will be in new containers. But what I was really impressed with was the Red Star Premier Rouge yeast. It fermented a little bit faster than the last ones and um, a little bit less sediment. It also has a very impressive clarity. You can see right through those. Yep, I am keeping them up in the closet so they are out of direct light. That's why the camera is having a little bit of struggle to see them. And yeah, just that, that color difference alone is crazy with the exact same ingredients <clears throat> what I did today though is this one it is a full strength regular mead it is made with three pounds of wildflower honey one cup of black tea 1.5 tablespoons of nutrients half a pack of R premier rouge yeast and with an original gravity of 1.080 and yeah, as you can see, it's in a slightly larger container because these, as I found out, are a gallon when they're full. So with a little bit of headspace that they have, it's not quite a gallon. So I accounted for that by having the, a bunch of these four liters. Yeah, I'll be slowly uh, only using these uh, one gallon ones for secondary and be using these larger ones for primary only. Seems like a pretty solid plan. <laughs> uh, I had to ta tape down the, the airlocks because they kept wanting to slip out. So far, so good. Just look at that color, though. <laughs>